Apocalypse mode, we will play as Ted. What did you just call me? <laughs> this soup doesn't look right, man. It, 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 it looks like, like a cabbage... Cabbage porridge. Okay, one moment, please. Why is he so slow? Oh my god, okay. So I'm just looking... Step one, most important thing in the house. Love you, honey. Just kidding, it's a briefcase. I, I'm just being honest with you. He doesn't feel like he controls right right now. Like he's he's on tank controls or something. I don't know. I did have to reinstall the game when I started today. Um, I don't. I, I didn't really know what was going on with that, but he he, he doesn't control right. He, I think he had a few too many schlitzes before the stream started today. Make sure you get Timmy. Thank you. Give a quick little checkerboard. Maybe a couple cases. Where is she? Where is she? I'm, I'm, I'm using my eyes. She must be in the kitchen. I'm echolocating. We're going to make it. We're going to make it. Don't don't put the knockout city at the edge of the screen. She's in the bathroom. Bro, he doesn't handle right. Water, water. Water, water everywhere. Not a drop to drink. Okay. I mean, we probably had a second. Take me down here. All right. I mean, this is... We got everybody. We don't have much else. Bro, she's not that good at the tuba. You are not wrong. No radio. I, I think I got like three cans of food. But the whole family's here. Dude, we got tons of soup down here. We got... We got the... Deck of cards was down here. We had a lock down here. That's not so bad. All right. Plus one lock. Plus one deck of cards. We got seven soup cans. Five bottles of water. That's that's pretty solid. Um, on day two, we will prepare Timmy to go outside. Sip your friends, baby. Okay. Day, day one doesn't matter. Everybody's chilling today. Day two, we prepare for a journey. We've been hearing strange noises. We should probably get busy with something to keep us occupied before this gets worse. Go ahead, play some checkers. You start playing checkers, that'll make everybody prefer silence and solitude. We, we want nobody to go crazy this time. Look at that, everybody's happy. Having some fun made us forget about our problems. Ted, have you met Ted? Timmy, you can take a little drink here. Because you're going out into the wilderness. Timmy, you're taking a briefcase. You're taking a gas mask. I don't. You know what? We got enough soup cans. Why don't you take a soup can with you as well? And uh, I, I can't imagine the deck of cards is worth something. But let's do it. We're doing full briefcase strats. My man's going to come back with one big arm like Tim Roth and the Incredible Hulk. Okay. Ted looks like he's got one foot in the grave. Dehydrated. Okay, well, you know, if you're going to be a baby about it, then fine. Take some water. We can't help but thinking about what we can make out of this terrible situation. Is our house still standing? Or will we have to move to some forsaken hole? Like Toronto. <laughs> oh! Mouth! <laughs> they owned you. They owned you, dude. They didn't... They knew. They probably originally wrote Vancouver into the draft. And then they were like, in the editing process, they were like, everybody loves it, it's beautiful there, the winters are remarkably mild, we gotta change it. We can make it work, even in Toronto. Question is, how do we find a boat to get there? We heard that th that's the best way to get to Europe. <laughs> oh, good one. Um, okay, hold on. Ted, Dolores, Mary Jane, your love and life. We always steered away from casinos, so when a man came to our door and told us he used to be a gambler, we were suspicious. He invited us to play a game. He proposed a two water bottle bet in a card game of our choice. Absolutely not, Chibli. Learn cursive and then get back to me. We say no. Yeah, this painting on the right side, I can't, uh, there we go, we got our mouse pointer. I don't, I don't know what it, uh, what it means, but it does signify something. Like, you get, you get stuff on the walls based on your response to some events. Um, I don't, I don't know what this one is. If you get the handprint, that means you're, like, dark side. You did evil stuff. Uh, like, like, raided the school or the retirement home. Um, hungry? 
Dolores. She's she's on intermittent fasting. This is just like another Thursday for her. We had the most curious visitors today. One of them was making the sound of a galloping horse using a pair of rocks. Hashtag Monty Python. Hashtag uh, Holy Grail. Timmy? No Timmy. If he doesn't come back, we might as well just alt F4. It'll be like disastrous. Ted is hungry. He needs some water. Mary Jane's hungry. She's also a little thirsty. Hungry, thirsty, thirsty, hungry. Head eyes, head jaws. Where did that green puddle come from? Oh dear, a pipe is leaking green goo. That's not good. That's not good at all. We need to act now and no one packed a mop. What do we do? That's unfortunate. We have nothing to, to deal with that. It's probably green goo. It's probably just our... Uh, it's just our compost line. We couldn't figure out what it was, so we just assumed it was what a regular pipe would do in the event of a nuclear apocalypse. Nobody's, uh, nobody got sick, at least immediately, though, which is nice. Let's take a look. We're doing great. Dehydration, starvation, hungry... De okay, dehydration's a gimme. Starvation equals you eat a can. We thought phone calls were a thing of the past after the atomic bomb obliterated everything in our little town. However, a phone booth on our street survived the bombing somehow. Okay, Dolores, I'm gonna get you to answer the phone. She always did love talking. She's doing great. She's so resilient. We learned from the last one. When we answered the phone, we heard a gasp of relief. Okay, so we got we got one line out there as an opportunity for, for possibly getting rescued. But I hate getting rescued by the other survivors. It actually takes, like, every possible... Uh, item. You need like radios, you need to give them a first aid kit. Like it's it's disastrous. Day 9 by the way. Hashtag, hashtag Sean in chat. Hashtag Sean. Hungry, hungry, starvation. A little soup for you. Some soup for you. We will not eat the nuclear mushrooms and Timmy comes back day 10. Timmy's probably dead. Timmy's coming back tomorrow. There you go. Starvation. She's starving. You could, you're gonna eat a quarter can of soup two days in a row? Jeez, uh, glut, gluttony much? As long as we have food and water, we can stay locked in, but we'll have to leave eventually. It would be good to head straight to safety. Um, unfortunately, we don't have a radio, so none of this matters. Okay. Pay by the word. Oh, Timmy's back. Oh, <laughs> uh, and he's freaking stacked. He brought us a first aid kit. He brought us an axe. He brought us the briefcase back. He brought us the gas mask. He brought us a Boy Scout manual. He did lose a deck of cards. For that, you have been banished from the land. Okay, he brought back briefcase gas mask. One can of soup, two bottles of water, one first aid kit, one fire axe. That's incredible. Uh, uh, we did lose the deck of cards. We got the, the survival manual. Hungry, thirsty, thirsty, hungry, thirsty, hungry, tired, starvation. You get to eat, Timmy. Congratulations. Because, oh, he brought the briefcase. Okay, so we're gonna, we'll probably send, like, Dolores out next time. We never thought we'd live to see a dancing cockroach. We still have him, but we saw one that was nearly as big as a cat. The good news is they probably scared off any rats in the area. Rat jams, thank you, thank you. The bad news is they are huge and will probably attack us. That's what the survivor survival manual's for. I don't like hearing flies, man. It makes me think somebody died. What happened to the soup? We dodged a bullet this time. That is, if a bullet was huge, Harry had eight legs and a glowing head. Hopefully, we don't have to deal with them again. I don't. I don't look at their vitals, okay? Like I just, I just check the the vitals in admin. Hungry, dehydration, tired, thirsty, hungry, dehydrated. Everybody's dehydrated or thirsty. Go ahead, take some water. And if we're going to send Dolores out, she gets a little soup can as well. Dolores, briefcase, gas mask, day 12, we'll, we'll, we'll still take gas mask. Take an axe with you, and we got enough soup to... Yeah, we got enough soup to send you with a soup can, just to see how it goes. Dude, this is going very well. Can of LaCroix, and she'll be alright. I'll cheers to that, brother. She went out like a ninja turtle. Okay. 
Now, starvation, hungry, tired, hungry, head, eyes, head, jaws. Our patience is wearing thin. We thought it would be a good idea to take a look outside. As we were about to step out, a pair of animal eyes flashed in the darkness. I have never had any of this merchandise, and as a result, I cannot, uh, I cannot provide us with a dog on this one. I apologize. It can't be done. They have run away, though. Use a little food. Food? Hungry? Hungry? Timmy. Timmy got back to the shelter from his expedition, but it turned out he hurt his hand on a piece of rusty metal and the wound was infected. It doesn't look like it's healing up. We have to patch it. Look, Timmy, you brought home a first aid kit? To the victor go the spoils. If you bring home medicine, I'm not gonna be like, you can't have this medicine. Did you know, so I, I kind of thought that tetanus was like not that big of a deal. Um, I mean, I guess something like 30 people die in North America from it every year. So it's, you know, compared to something like heart disease or stroke or whatever, is it's it's not that common. But I, I honestly thought that it was like when you get tetanus, they just give you an injection and you're like good to go. If you actually come down with it, there's like a 50% chance you die. That's crazy, man. I had no idea. I, I, I honestly thought it was just kind of like the flu. I hate to say it, like, I, I, it exposes my own ignorance, but I, I, I genuinely thought they would give you, like, some acetaminophen or something like that, and then be like, hey, here's, like, some antibiotics, go to sleep. But instead, they're like, get your affairs in order. Anyway, so get, get your boosters, yeah. Um, okay, minus one first aid kit. Hungry, thirsty, thirsty, starvation. You get a little soup. Some soup for you. When we opened this door, we let in some radioactive air and discovered a small suitcase on our doorstep. There was no note on it in the neighborhood node empty. Should we take a look inside? Honestly, the fact that this is glitched and just says no makes me think that that's our decision uh, for this one. I, I think that's a sign from above. We got enough resources here. This is like no problem. We could do all family save run here. I don't think I've ever done it. Okay. Vitals. Dehydrated, dehydrated, dehydrated. You love to see the family in sync like that. When you live together in a bunker for so long, you get on the same cycle. Why, why does it, it keeps popping up? No, man. We were about to go to sleep when we heard someone knocking on the door. How in the heck did they survive the nuke? Should we open up? No. <laughs> Let's go! Full isolationist build. Oh my god. I'm looking. We lost the briefcase, which sucks. Soup's looking good. Water's looking good. Little bug spray. She brought back the axe, at least. Okay. She brought back three bottles of water. And look at this tiny man. Yeah, hold on. What's up with that? I've never... I don't know if I've ever seen that before. Maybe, is, are these the firefighters? They handed us a can of bug spray and asked us not to tell anyone what we saw here. We're not sure why. We spotted some sort of vehicle just down the street, but couldn't get a good enough look at it in the dark. Maybe future expeditions will prove more fruitful. All right. Well, I mean, like, it's pretty sick. Don't get me wrong. We're, 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 we're more stacked now than we were when we came in here. Hungry? Hungry, hungry, tired, starvation. Looks like you you are the weakest link. Enjoy your meal. We will definitely go on another expedition. As long as... Okay, they want us to get a radio again. Unfortunately, I have no control over that. Dunk, dunk. Everybody's looking pretty good. They get a thousand yard stare, but so what? Okay. Um, hungry, starvation. Hungry... Hungry. Timmy, you get to eat because you're going out on the next expedition. We're going to just give you a gas mask to make sure you don't get sick. He's the strongest amongst us. Send MJ? I don't know, man. She's not looking like... I don't know if she has the mental fortitude to survive. But Ted, we can't send Ted. Like, look at him. Just look at him. 
Would you, if you look like this, would you want it? This is like Stu from uh, Rugrats. He's lost control of his life. And then Dolores, we just sent out. I think Timmy's the. Timmy's hungry. That's who we want out there. Dehydrated. Starvation. Dehydrated. We don't have a radio game. It is like Ted. Okay, this is. I don't mean this to be rude. Many people have said that Mathis has daddy energy in 2021. Ted Day 1 is like Mathis 2016. Ted Day 19 is Mathis 2021. This is Chiluminati Mathis. Clean Cut Ted uh, is, is Kenshi Mathis. <laughs> um, anyway, Matt, lo love you Mathis. I heard you're ripping it up in Knockout City. I'm glad to hear it. Our paths may cross. Dehydrated, hungry, tired, hungry, hungry, dehydrated, okay? We paid a visit, we were paid a visit today by a young man worried about his twin sister. He seems to trust us fully. He asked that we come to his aid in his hour of need and really good things might happen to us if we manage to succeed. All right, Mary Jane, it's your turn. <laughs> Did you hear that? That was a gunshot. The young man was assisted. We found the girl, threw her a weapon, and fought off the bandits guarding the exit. So the siblings were happy to be reunited, but also very confused. Turns out the bandit leader is actually their father. What is this? The Maury Povich show? Does, does anybody even understand? Is that show even still on the air? Maury's got to be like 93 years old. I apologize. Crazy. Small world we live in. Anyway, they were really thankful and promised to contact us again soon. How about that? Starve, tired, hungry, hungry, head eyes. Mary Jane keeps a diary. No, we will not violate her uh, her privacy. A diary is is private for a reason. I'm not sweating Timmy yet. Ted is um, Gardic phone is originally supposed to be a man drawing a thumbs up. Four people in a row drew a man with a thumbs up. Chibli uh, drew a man holding an F and then mouth turned it into a gun. Fatigued. Whatever. Who cares? Thirsty starvation. Join the club. Uh, it's called Everybody. <laughs> and they meet at the bar. When someone knocked on our door, we were suspicious and cautious, but after a few minutes of talking, it turned out it was a group of old ladies who were at a tea party not far from here when the bombs dropped. We thought it would be good manners to talk to them face to face. When we opened the door, those old bats attacked us with their umbrellas, canes, and something that looked like a spiked table leg. We need to fight back. Spray them. Bug spray, least valuable tool right now. What the heck is this? This looks like another Gardic phone drawing. We lost the bug spray, but that's okay. It's normally used for killing insects, but as long as you get it in their eyes, the reaction is quite instant, Mr. Powers. Ted is hungry. Ted needs water to survive. Tell me something I don't know. Dude, we're doing great on, on rations still. There's an armed and dangerous woman outside. Fortunately, she's out of ammo. She tells us she hunts the wild beasts of the wastes. And right now she's on a trail of a giant mutated spider. We're pretty sure she's lost her mind. What are you going to do with that spider, lady? Put it on a leash? Minecraft reference. She promises that if we help her, she will return the favor another day. Timmy? Not today. Not today. I'm I'm a little scared about Timmy, but we've been we've been reading more, which means we're slowing down, which means we shouldn't be sweating it quite yet. We don't have a radio. Where's the radio, Drake? Timmy's killing it. Okay, Timmy brought back a first aid kit. Timmy brought back. I mean, honestly, it seems like maybe he brought some soup as well. It, it seems like he did a great job. First aid kit is insanely valuable. Two cans of soup, first aid kit. That's beautiful. Timmy, you did a great job. Starving? Glad I gave him the soup before we sent him out. You never know. 
Okay. Did it, hold on, I need to go back. Did it say that we're scared? The vehicle from down the street looked like someone's work in progress. We've observed it from afar. Who could the owner be? All right, we haven't been observed yet, I think. So we don't have to worry about, like, defending ourselves. The state of the wasteland remains unknown to us. Let me, let me take a look. Fatigued, hungry, tired, hungry, hungry. Mary Jane, I'm, I might even double soup you. We'll see. On our way back, we noticed some drawings on a half-ruined wall nearby. It was a very crude map of our town, and one place was marked with an X. Maybe it's someone's secret stash of soup. Who should go check? Dolores, man. Dolores. This one, this is just real life, man. She got some cards. Look at that. Easy. Okay. Ted, starving. Hungry, thirsty. Hungry? That's why we double soup. Thirsty, hungry? Whatever, you're fine. How can you be tired and fatigued? Come on, pick one. You freaking millennial. Okay, Mary Jane, enjoy your gas mask. I mean, I I don't see us losing before day 60. Like, we're killing it here. We'll probably lose, but we might not lose before day 60. We got so many resources, man. Five bottles of water? That was like one hungover morning. Fatigued, thirsty, hungry. Dehydrated and starving? Hungry, dehydrated? Well, take some, take some water. A sleazy-looking trader paid us a visit. He offered us a simple one-time deal. For one can of soup, we get the bag and all of its contents. This gives us a cool cat, right? This gives us a, a neat cat. I think we gotta take it. We got enough soup. This is where you leverage. You trade things you got a lot of for things you got a, a little of. Look at that. Well, you can't. Meow. It's me, meow. All these people do is complain about how hungry and thirsty they are. Like, come on, get a hobby. What's that in your pocket, Timmy? Oh no, mutated ants. Their terrifying little mandibles almost gave Dolores a heart attack. She wants them out, but Timmy says it's the beginning of an atomic ant farm. One of them has to have their way, but who? Um, I think we should get rid of the, the ants. My prediction, we want to get rid of the ants, especially when we have no uh, bug spray in case they get out of control. Timmy was mortified. Wow, she actually killed them. I thought she was just gonna put them outside or something. Timmy, are you okay? You're not psychologically destroyed when your pets were killed in front of you. Okay. It's difficult to prepare for unforeseen circumstances. What can we say? We can't, we can't say we were prepared for what happened. Faint knocking. Knocking, knocking at my chamber door. Starving. Soup's getting a little low. But I'm not sweating it just yet. The siblings kept their word and visited us again. Will you give them your axe? Yes, because it's one of the only ways we can get out of here. MJ has returned. What'd she get? Bug spray? Bullets? Another axe? Another briefcase? She's incredible. We do need some soup, but like, that's amazing. Two water bottles. Bullets, bug spray. Suitcase. I mean, this is like the easiest run I've ever had up to this point. Yeah, you do need both, okay. Dehydrated, hungry? Tired, hungry, tired, fatigued. Thirsty, hungry. I'm going to be honest. Ted, you're going out into the wasteland next. So I'm going to make sure we, we... A failure to plan is a plan to fail. The only thing we're missing is a radio. Drunk high? <laughs> is it people emerging from their homes? Uh, in July 2021. Fatigued. He's good to go. Fatigued, hungry, no sweat. Thirsty, starvation. Fatigued, hungry. Okay. Ted, 
we're still gonna give you a gas mask. We're gonna give you a water bottle because we got plenty of water to go around. And I think we'll, we'll just give you something random. Like, why don't you take the survival manual, man? Let's. I don't. I don't know. Let's just see how it goes. Give him an extra hand. My zoops. Two and a two and a half cans of super main. Dehydrated. You can drink all the water. Just drink hungry, or <laughs> just drink hungry. Just drink water until you're not hungry anymore. Sharikov can take care of itself, but we can't help but wonder how much of a self-made cat it is. It just so happens we found an address on its collar. It's unlikely the owner is still alive, and a trip to the wasteland is always risky. Shall we go outside and check that address? Why not? Why not? We're basically superheroes here. Stop knocking at my door. Um, oh, we shrugged and went back to our shelter. The cat didn't seem to care, so why should we? Good thing we didn't get attached to it the past few days. Oh, right, that's it. And then we, I think we get contacted by the owner or something later. I don't know, we'll see. I'm not worried about it for the, for the time being. Hungry, thirsty, hungry, hungry, tired, thirsty, starvation. We were discussing plans for our first meal that didn't feature tomato soup. When we heard yells outside, we discovered they came from a small group of ragged survivors. They were a sorry sight, and we weren't surprised they requested aid. They asked us to provide anything we could, water, food, or medical supplies. We got a real surplus of water, so enjoy that. They gave us a radio! Let's go! Stop drawing this, man! You're freaking the kids out! Dehydrated. Dehydrated. This is a joyful time. It's Timmy's birthday. We waited until the last minute to give him a present. What is he getting this year? Uh, it's a checkerboard with six checkers per side. And he didn't break it. It's a dream come true. Okay, Ted, he's got a few days before he has to come back. But we are very much hoping he returns with some soup. Turn on some radio chatter. Uh, excuse me? Meow? Welcome back, Sharikov. Don't eat my soup, please. Yo, we, we got some tips that mentioned a few helpful tips to make it easier for us to survive the next expedition. How about the current expedition? Because I'm a little concerned Ted has been crossed out here. Curiosity almost killed the cat. Sharikov found a tiny wire sticking out from the ceiling and pulled it out. Plaster and debris fell on our table. Topped off with a big meowing furball. What is this thing anyway? No one remembers it being there. The cat might get angry if we take away the wire. Let's examine the wire. I think this, this is how we get CIA ending. Okay, Ted. Ted's back. He did not bring soup and his gas mask broke. What the hell did you do, Ted? What'd you get? Two water bottles? So you traded the gas mask and the scout manual for two water bottles? I mean, you can't drink paper. So I do appreciate the fact that you got some water at least, but we're kind of, it's not fantastic. Let's put it that way. I, I need to look at the flavor text again. We think someone followed us. Let's hope this doesn't happen again. Okay. We might just try to ride out the ride out a couple weeks here until it's absolutely necessary for us to leave again. We finally get on the, on the fifth attempt, we get to listen to the radio there. Oh, oh, one moment. Okay. I need to I'm going to check the Discord real quick as a result of my wife's request here. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No no worries. I don't want to dono while my own wife. <laughs> we knew it. The government has not fallen and they're coming to save us. They said they will be in touch in a couple days and told us to await further instructions. Okay. 
Well, you know, it has been 38 days. That's kind of a... It's a long time. When we've only got one and a quarter cans of soup left. We're not going out on an expedition yet. The agents want to explain themselves. They were spying on us. We were part of a YouTube social experiment. Can you give me some soup for my trouble, at least? We saw their identity cards. They were interested in the cat. They wanted us to aid them in their top secret missions. If we do that, they will extract us to a government safe house full of donuts. How about you give me half the donuts now and half the donuts upon completion of the task as a very common uh, payment arrangement? The friendly survivor group is back. They succeeded in building a small cozy camp. People are starting to move in and between them are quite a few children. Some of these kids get in trouble way too often. Well, you know what? Sorry, Timmy. But your birthday present now belongs to the other squad. Ted's stomach is rumbling? Well, sorry, you can't eat checkers anyway. I think we're getting close to being in the, um... To, to being rescued by the survivors. With three quarters of a can of soup remain. It's a god tier run, but it's also a little scary. Mary Jane found a single plant seed. We have no idea what kind of seed it is. We need to use a bottle of water to plant it. You know what? Send it. Maybe it'll grow cat food. <clears throat> or something better. Smoke leaf? Honestly, this would be a great time to be starving because you want to eat that soup early before things get super dangerous. Dolores was furious. Mary Jane was going on a date with a bandit boy. Can she write a note to apologize for not going out there? Yes, absolutely. Go ahead. Excuse me. I thought you were just going to slide it under the door or something. Okay, the boy was eaten by a mutant raccoon. No sweat. Starvation. Dehydration? Dehydration starvation? We have a quarter can left. We must prepare for an expedition. Ted and Mary Jane have been butting heads lately. Today they got into an argument about movie characters. She wears a crown and came down in a bubble, dog. You know that video? Today they got in an argument about movie characters. Who would win in a battle? Peter Pan or an army of mutated cockroaches? It's a tricky one for sure, and the debate is heated. Who will come out on top? Um, well, if Mary Jane said mutated cockroaches, I vote for her. How mutated we talking? Mary Jane objectively won the debate with the sheer volume of her voice. Uh, pretty sus. Don't lie to me, Walt. Ted was begging her to stop complaining about a nauseating headache. Dehydrated. Starvation. We're out of soups. Who, who's going out today? It's gotta, it's gotta be Dolores. Dolores, you're eating, and then you're going out there with, the, with your briefcase intact. And... Uh, uh, <laughs> just, and, uh, and an axe. And then two empty hands to bring back stuff. Yo, science cheese. Thank you for the gifted subscriptions. Thank you. Wait, growing a little soup can. We got a little plant growing there. We're getting there. Starvation is going to get pretty nasty. MJ's not in a great spot. One of our neighbors had a shelter with a broken trap door. There might be supplies inside. No. We will not become evil and gate ourselves off from, from possible survival and success. We will not. If we... Sure, spray yourself with some bug spray or whatever. Um, if we give up our morals, 
We've already died. We've already become the monsters we sought to defeat. Fatigue, tired, hungry, thirsty. Fatigue, starvation, sick, and dehydrated. You can take your first aid kit, Timmy. Um, any means of cutting a beard is acceptable. Thank God we took the axe so that Ted didn't try to uh, shave his, uh, his face with a fireman's axe. The, dude, the, you gotta eat those. You gotta eat those. Come on, don't die on me, MJ. We got little fruits coming out here. That plant is growing like crazy. We've never grown carrots or anything, so we're not sure if glowing in the dark is normal. Maybe it's a good time to collect whatever food is, uh, fruit is produced. Yes, it must be done. We have no choice. Uh, <laughs> oh, four cans of soup, though. Let's go. She got a little sick, but we got four cans of soup. We were able to procure four cans of food from it. Starve. Starvation. Dehydration. <laughs> Starvation. Okay, we're back. Another broadcast. Use playing cards. Dude, we're making it. Dolores! First aid kit. No first aid kit and she's sick. On the other hand, she did get a flashlight. And a checkerboard, yet again. Starvation. 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 We're somewhat popping off. I don't really want to do another raid right now. Maybe it's the friendly face of an American soldier at the door. Should we open it up? At this point, please rescue us. We've earned it. The end. We won. Everybody, everybody lived. The survivors saved us. Dude, I didn't expect it to happen. We were ecstatic when our friends came over today to officially invite us into their new camp. The siblings said they're incredibly grateful for the help and assistance we've provided. They claim the whole thing wouldn't be possible without us. They've already made a separate house for us, all furnished with some of our own supplies. And there are plenty of families waiting to meet us there. We can't wait to be between people again. Maybe the world isn't as bad as it looks. We can't wait to start our new, more peaceful and normal life. Goodbye, little shelter. You have been our home for a long time. But today it's time to move on and the future is looking really bright. Mary, Mary Jane is starving. She needs food today or else. <laughs> Look at this. Who would have thought? Light side ending. You survived. 10 cans of soup, 10 cans of water. End adventure. It was just a we, full family survival. Who would and the game crashed. Um, slash marker, end of run one. That was a great one though. I had a wonderful time.